Hello, my dear students. I welcome you all to your history online class. So, in today's online class, we will focus on your ninth chapter from your international or contemporary history that is known as the Great Depression of the USA, standing talking about the United States of America in the year of 1929. So, we see that there were lots of causes, lots of reaction when there was exactly a wall street crash which occurred mainly in the month of september and it got ended in the year of october 1929 so based on this topic lots of people of america nation had to face a problem regarding the stock market exchange which got really down and the people of america had to face unemployment problem the banks had to be closed for certain months so those kinds of problem was specially faced by the american citizen so let's start the class so first we will see that what was exactly the causes leading to the Wall Street crash of 1929. So let's see the first talking about introduction part that the Great Crash. That means even the Great Depression of 1929 is also known as the Great Crash where a uh, stock exchange. There was a stock exchange crash in American nation in the month of September and it got end in the month of October 1929 and we see that the share prices of New York, one of the main city or the states of American nation, even the stock exchange got collapsed. It got com completely declined, downfall. So based on that topic, we see that how the citizens of America had to face a major problem regarding their jobs, regarding their health, regarding their financial problem and all this problem really created a great depression for America nation of 1929 and after the America had to face this kind of problem again in the month of September same year 1929 again there was a crash there was a collapse in the country called England under talking about the London stock exchange which also got crashed just a month later after America's great depression. So after all these kinds of problem, what was exactly the causes? What mainly related to this topic made the nations to go very down, their financially, their economic system went very down and especially the citizens had to face problem. And based on that, we'll just discuss or we'll just see the main causes or the highlighting points related to 1929 Great Crash or Great Depression. So first we see with the low wages, that means when the stock exchange got collapsed, when the share market of New York also got collapsed, based on that, many of the people or the citizens of America, they had to go against, so they had to, uh, they did not got any such kind of jobs. There was lots of un un unemployment and based on that, whoever got jobs, those who could retain or those who could restore their jobs, they got less amount of wages working for eight hours, working for 10 hours, whatever was the duration or the time given by the company or by the industrialist, they were given low wages. Second, we see that the struggling agriculture sector. So agriculture, we all know it is the backbone for all the nation because lots of production, cultivation of wheat, barley, all different kinds of cash crops, rabi crops, all these have been grown with the help of land. And based on that also, we see the farmers of the American nation had to face a struggling obstacle based on the crash no such kind of economic were weighed down no such kind of finance was been given by the american government and even they had to face a problem next we see talking about the excess of large bank loan so when there was a great crash when there was a great depression in america in 1929 america had to take lots of loan they had to take lots of credit from the other nation in huge number and that started piling up with lots of interest in the form of compound interest too and that also became one of the major causes for the Great Depression. Next, we talk about the credit boom. So same topic related with all those kinds of credit taken by America from all respective nations who were actually the friend of America because this is the year we're talking about 1929. And if you remember, 1914 to 1918 is the year where there was the first world war between Triple Alliance and Triple Antin. And Triple Antin, they were able to get victory over Germany and Germany were made to sign Treaty of Versailles in 1919 and the League of Nations was formed in 1920 and nine years later this Great Depression took place. Next causes we will see talking about the investment on weapon industry. So America they with huge finance with huge amount in money matter they had spent in the weapons arms ammunition industries. 
And let me tell you one more thing that when America started making all these kinds of weapons and all, after that for at least 10 to 15 years there was no such kind of war. And whatever the weapons was being produced by America, that got weighed down. There was no other countries who were willing to buy arms, ammunition from America country. And again, the economic system went very down. Next number six, we talk about the weakness in the banking system. So wherever the banking system existed in America, either the private bank or the public bank, even the loan was being taken in huge number by the people and they were not able to give those kinds of loans with the rate of interest and that also made a very severe blow to face this kinds of depression of 1929 talking about the causes. So these six mainly the causes talks about the Great Depression of 1929, how America had to face a problem, the citizens of America after the stock exchange got down, their share market of New York also got down and later on their friendly nation talking about England also their stock exchange got down, it got collapsed and all these reasons made definitely the nations America to go in a very problem way facing lots of obstacles with banking system with agriculture system and they wanted to restore the economic system as they were before and last but not the least talking about the president so when we talk about the president we see that what kind of role is being taken by president and during those years even in america we see that Woodrow wilson who played a very important role regarding the 14 points based on the league of nations and the five main objectives or the organs of the League of Nations had to face a defeat in the next election and there was also the rise of a new president from the Republican Party in the year of 1939 known as Harding. So Harding after being the president of America in 1929 he took lots of measures in order to restore whatever the economic system of America had gone down but he was not so overwhelmed to have lots of problems to face or he had no such kind of good ideas to tackle though whatever was his idea he could do but overall he could not make the america as it was before with this great depression of 1929 so this was overall the topics with the soft topics mainly talking about the causes of the great depression of 1929 i hope you have understood the topic the explanation that i gave you in today's class till then stay safe thank you and god bless